It's a disease we thought was gone for good with an effective vaccine and almost no cases. But as NBC 15's Kate Pabish explains, measles is making a comeback, targeting the most vulnerable. And doctors say it's only a matter of time before it hits Wisconsin. Do you think with Minnesota and Illinois both having reported cases, Wisconsin's going to see it soon? I would be amazed if we didn't. Extremely contagious. And so these very tiny droplets of particles which can travel through the air because they're very light and they can go everywhere. Very uncomfortable. People will get a high fever, they'll get a rash. It will often start with a runny nose, a pink eye, and then the rash starts from the face and goes down to the rest of the body. And sometimes deadly. It's not the measles that will cause problems, it's the complications of it that happen after the fact. So people will get ear infections, they'll get pneumonia, they'll get meningitis. With a vaccine that it's been around for half a century. It's come back in a big way. It's a surprise for doctors, to say the least. You know, it's only eradicated to the extent that everybody stays vaccinated. Be it opposition to vaccinations or just thinking it's unnecessary this day and age. Doctors say too many people made that choice and now are putting babies who can't be vaccinated yet and people with compromised immune systems at risk. It's a responsibility that people have to protect the others around them, not just themselves. To show just how contagious it is, we set up this camera in our newsroom. Watch this man sneeze. And now let's assume he's infected. And for the next two hours, anyone who walks in that area will soon catch measles. You're contagious for four days before you get the rash, so you could be out and about in all sorts of places spreading it. Doctors say the only way to protect your unimmunized baby or child is to call ahead to school or daycare to check their immunization policy for both children and caregivers. And if it's laxed, keep them home. It's a really contagious disease. And if you do think your baby is coming down with the measles, they say keep them home and call the doctor first so not to infect anyone else in the process. In Madison, Kate Pavish, NBC 15 News. And doctors say so far in 2015, there have been more than 100 cases in the U.S. There is no medication you can take to get rid of the measles. You just need to wait it out. They say children require two shots of the MMR vaccine, and if you're just getting the vaccine as an adult, you only need one. There are free vaccines available at Public Health of Dane County in Madison, and you can also check your vaccination records easily through the Wisconsin Immunization Registry. Find that link by heading to NBC15.com and clicking on News Links.